So let's just table this discussion and we will reconvene on Monday. Thanks, guys. Hey, Jono. Hmm? Uh, sorry, I don't mean to bug you after your meeting or anything, but um, did you delete me on Instagram? I actually did that a while ago. I'm just, I'm surprised that you found out. Oh, <laughs> yeah, well, I, I keep track of my followers. So when my count drops, I use an app and it shows me who I lost. So I noticed that you were one of them. It's just cleaning house. Cleaning house? Yeah, every few months I go through and purge people I don't want to see anymore. Purge? Wow, okay. Uh, it's a little harsh, isn't it? Sorry? No, it's just that, like, the movies, you know, they, they kill a lot of people in those, so. It just It's interesting that you would use that word to describe cutting me out of your life. I'm not cutting you out of my life. I just want to see more interesting content on my timeline. And yet I haven't posted in like a month, so. It's not like you were scrolling and you were like, oh, oh, okay, yeah, there it is. Danny has shitty content. I need to delete her. No, you went in and you manually found me to delete. You had intentions. Yeah, you're right. My intention was to not see you on Instagram anymore. Why are you being so hurtful? I thought that we were friends. We are friends. Then why are you blocking me? I don't know. Okay, maybe I see your face all the time at work and I don't want to see it on my phone anymore and maybe I'm just tired of seeing so many photos of your goddamn cat. Maybe that's why. <laughs> you love Snowflake. What are you talking about? I lied. I'm allergic to your shitty cat and your shitty posts. <sighs> wow. Okay. Well, then I guess I'll just see you at the 2 o'clock meeting today. Yes. I guess you will. Great. Hey, don't unfollow me though, please. I'm almost, I'm almost a, I'm almost to 500 followers. Okay, well, not anymore. That's pretty much it.